tayong mga Pinoy sa hilig natin sa mga K-drama series, aba, hindi lang kultura nilang ating na-adapt, maging ang kanilang pagkain. Paano nga ba gumawa ng masarap na kimchi rice? Yan ang ating alamin kasama si Tito Cocinero sa Sarap Pinoy. Rise and shine, Pilipinas, and welcome to Sarap Pinoy. My name is Chef Jonathan Landingen, or as people would call me, Tito Cucinero. Yeah, and today we are gonna be cooking kimchi fried rice. Para doon sa mga nagbabudget, mga students na kailangan ng quick meals, pag pumasok ng school, kailangan yung mabilis ang baon, pambigay kay teacher. Mm -hmm. O, ba? Diba? Today we are gonna be cooking something fast, efficient, and of course, less costly para sa inyong mga students. So tara, luto tayo! So itong kimchi fried rice, no, bago tayo mag-start, uh, isang dish to na actually kinonceptualized ng wife ko, inagaw ko lang sa kanya. But the premise is to create a dish na syempre papatok sa uso ngayon, which is K-pop, di ba? So, dito muna tayo. Mag-init tayo ng ating wok. Ayan. Mas maganda gumamit ng wok. Kasi bakit? Para syempre lahat ng heat concentrated sa pagliluto. At the same time, malalim siya. Para pag nag-mix tayo ng rice later, walang tatapon masyado. So, okay. Start off with a bit of vegetable oil. And magigisa tayo ng mga vegetables and meat, we will just be using vegetable oil. Garlic tends to cook faster, so unahin mo natin yung onions natin. Lagyan natin yung onions. Uy, ang ganda ng pagkasizzle ng onions. Then some garlic. Then, gisa tayo. Then, carrots na tayo ha. Habang nagliluto yan, pupunta tayo sa ating sauce base. Okay. Very important ingredient is the gochujang or Korean chili paste. Ayan, ito yung magbibigay ng spice. Bit of oyster sauce. Yun. So once that's done, we go to our beef. Okay, our beef is to be actually, kaya ganito yung color ng beef. It was already cooked overnight. Okay, and then uh, you can marinate this with some soy sauce and some garlic. So we're gonna throw this inside. Yun. So and then, put in some cabbage here. Just so mayroon tayong konting greens konting brown sugar, you could add the taste. Now, we add our rice. And then, of course, sesame oil. Black pepper. Yeah. So, sa finishing tayo, uh, you could use uh, spring onions, you could use leeks. Ganda ng onion leeks natin, no? This is around one and a half cups of rice. Meron pang enough for, ano, round two. So, ayan. So, kung like, Ano kayo, gumagawa kayo ng assignment, ng thesis, or nagsa-study break kayo? Ayan. Perfect. Have our spring onions. Let me see, babaw. And there you have it. One of Tito Cucinero's or Chef Jonathan's specialty dishes, kimchi fried rice for those on a budget. Students, or even the working class, if you want a quick dish na madaling lutuin, this is the way to go. Hmm. So, ito yung pinaka-inaantay ng lahat, yung tiki man time. So, let's see. Okay ba siya? Papasa? Hmm. Kimchi fried rice. Isang subo. Ang good. Hmm. Hindi ka pa nalulunok. Ang sarap. Tama yung anghang. Kaya lang, sakto. K-pop fanatics, you will like this. Ang sarap. Kasi sabi mo sarap siya, dahil ako nagluto. Masarap talaga siya. Ayan. Perfect. So mga ka-RSP, I hope you learned something today sa ating Dutu session sa Sarap Pinoy. If na-miss niyo yung ating episode for today, just follow us on our FB or IG page right here sa baba. Okay? Do follow me on my own uh, personal social media pages on FB or on Instagram, Jedi Chef J or Tito Cucinero. So we hope you learned something. Tito out! See you guys!